guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Danny, and i'm back with another video so today i wanted to do a really quick video of a tattoo tour or my tattoo collection um i have i don't even know how many tattoos i have i guess we'll count them together as we go but i've been seeing these videos a lot and i thought it would be cool if i did it as well um before we get started though this is like my new setup um i am officially settled into my new home and this is like the best setup i can find i low-key really like it um i may switch up the pillows or you know make it a little more cutesy um i do have some flowers in the corner but um yeah so if y'all like this setup if y'all can see me and you think it's cute let me know if i should just change the pillows or if I should find a new location, hopefully it's clear and bright because I do have some big windows over there and I also have a window behind me. So yeah, but yeah, let's just jump right into the tattoo tour because I don't want to take up all your time, beautiful people. I really don't. So let's just jump right into it. So I'm going to go in order that I got them in, or at least I'm going to try. So the very first tattoo that I got is actually on my ankle. And I got this tattoo of my twin brother and my mother when I was in high school. We three went together and we went to one of our homeboys, friends, we got the tattoos in a garage. It was like really freaking hood. And I'm not opposed to like hood tattoos as long as it's clean. So yeah, I will insert a picture of my first tattoo, which is just my name on my ankle. And I know a lot of the times, you know, we get our names on us and it's like, why? Because I know my name, but I got my name on my ankle. So yeah. Um, so that was my first tattoo and I'll insert a picture probably over here so that you guys can see that one. Um, the pain level was maybe like a seven because that was my first tattoo. So to me, it was really painful. Um, the next tattoo I got is, I want to say this one right here, which is on my wrist. So this is the next tattoo I got and it is my Zodiac sign. Looks like a six and a nine. Um, I am a cancer. My birthday is July 10th. So that is the second tattoo I got. And it actually was shaded in pink at one point. It was shaded in pink. Um, but as you can see, I've had it so long, the color is actually faded away. Um, I definitely would go back and get more color added and actually get it cleaned up. Because once again, y'all, this was a hood tattoo. I got this one in college. One of my friends, he had just started learning how to do tattoos. And he was looking for people that wanted them. And I was like, me. So yeah, that's the second one I got. Um, the pain on this one was probably like a nine. This is a super sensitive area and it really did freaking hurt. But um, I kind of regret this one, to be honest. Um, the next one I got uh, were these three hearts. So I actually got these three hearts in Houston me and my sorority sister and my best friend danielle we were out in houston one weekend and we was just like let's go get tattoos it was a drunk night and we wanted to get tattoos so that's what we did i got these hearts for my mom my grandma and my brother they mean the world to me so um that is what i did and i got three hearts and they are shaded in red these are super special to me because they're for my family so they're super special to me and I know my shirt keeps falling. This is actually an off-the-shoulder shirt, but for video purposes, I just pulled it down so that you guys would be able to see all my tattoos. The next tattoo that I got was the one that you guys always freaking see, and it is my Forever Natural tattoo. This has to be one of my favorite tattoos. It says Forever Natural, and I got this one because, of course, I've been natural forever. It's a journey that I have been embarking on for 28 years. I've never had a relaxer or perm or anything of that nature, so it's really important to me um, to be forever natural. And another thing is I don't wear loads and loads of makeup. I don't wear false eyelashes and all those type of things. I'm more on the natural side, so that's another reason why I did get forever natural. But yeah, this was done in Louisiana, and it is one of my favorites. I really, really, really like this one. Moving right along, I actually skipped around in the timeline because the ones on my back I got before these. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn around. So this California one is actually one that I got in college. 
and it's the state of California. It has California going through, and it actually has um, where I'm from, which is Pittsburgh, California. It has the star right there. So yeah, this was one of my bigger tattoos. What I wanna do is I wanna go ahead and fill it in with like a California bear, the poppy, because that's where I'm from. So yeah, that's that one. Sorry if I'm giving y'all side boob, but that's that one. I also have Carpe Diem right here. And Carpe Diem means seize the day. So I have that one right there. This one right here, and it is a daisy. My aunt passed away, and her name was Arnice. And that's her name going across the top, and we called her Daisy. So I got a Daisy. This one was jam-packed with color. As you can see, the grass is green. Behind the Daisy is blue, and in the middle of the Daisy is yellow. This is like my biggest freaking tattoo. I want to continue it and wrap it around and start a sleeve. But yeah, that's that one. Then I went on and I got my birthday right here, and it is in Roman numerals. July 10th, 1989. So yeah, got my birthday in Roman numerals. I really like that one. So my birthday, this Forever Natural, and the next one I'm gonna show you was all done by the same guy, guy in Louisiana, and he does an awesome job. He also did this tattoo right here, which is fading away, and it says free. So I went through a lot when I was in college before I moved to Atlanta and once when I was about to move to Atlanta I got this tattoo that says free because I officially finally felt free after all the freaking drama I went through I felt free so that is why I got this one I'm left-handed so I didn't think about the fact that I was getting it on my left hand so you know over time it is starting to fade away so that's that one and I think that is it um, I do plan on getting more tattoos. I actually want to um, get a sleeve. So I plan on continuing this one on my back. I plan on continuing this one. And I plan on taking it around here. And I plan on making a half sleeve. So that's my plan. Um, I don't exactly know when I'm going to do it. But that is my plan. But yeah, those are all my tattoos. If you guys want me to walk through all my piercings... I will. But yeah, I hope you liked all my tattoos. I'll try to make sure that's it. But yeah, I'll just show you guys my tattoos one more time. Can't stop, won't stop, get guap. Ten white toes and them toy flip-flops. Manicures and pedicures, I'm always tip-top. When they say I'm not hot, all these lies need to stop. Cause I'm icy, wifey, haters wanna fight me. Never been the one get RP up on a whitey. Keep my hands clean, got some hitters moving shicey. Ask me if I'm on them. Those are all my tattoos. If you guys have any questions or want to know more about them, leave it down below. But I just want to do a quick video of my tattoo tour. Reporting live from the internet, signing out. Back to you, world. Bye, guys.